What's up, everybody? So welcome back to my channel, Green Man Grow 7. I'm Sean Knight, and today I got one. I got one um, that is one of my favorites. I have liked this plant for a very long time, and yeah. The Macaulay Finale Philodendron. Look at that. And this is a, a bigger plant than I normally hold up, but look at those cinnamon green. And then the green leaves that have the cinnamon on the leaves. Look at that baby right there. And if you can see the back, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And I like it because the way this plant grows, and if you can see, there is a new growth point here and if you can see within the growth point let me get closer to the camera you can see that it has like an orangish color in there this plant will always have multiple color leaves um and that makes it unique it makes it beautiful it gives it something a little different to uh feature and i'm gonna put it on the table because this sucker is heavy and then bring it closer Let's see if i can do that yeah and so Look at that. There we go. I just like that. And it's something different. This is not a, a climbing philodendron. This is only going to get maybe like three to five feet tall. And then the leaves will just get big. And that's it. I will say, though, you have to be careful if you have pets or children as we say with most plants, but this one, especially because I've noticed it has like uh, these little crystal things that you could see, it looks like a little crystal and um, that's toxic. So if a, a child touches it and put their hands in their mouth and or if a pet licks the leaves and something, it could be toxic. Or if you lick the leaf, don't do that. But yeah, I just wanted to bring that in that something. And the leaves are that shiny. This is not me doing something to enhance. It's just that shiny. The only thing I've done is clean the leaves off. And so, but, isn't that beautiful? I like it. I like it a lot. I like it. And see, like I always say with my collection, I want to have multiple different things. I want to have some plants that bind, that's crawling up. I want to have some plants that grow into trees that's going to be just that, like this Deffenbachia that's over here. It's just going to continue to grow and grow up like a tree, but this one isn't. It's going to just get to a certain height, and the only difference is, is that the leaves will continue to grow wide and grow a little longer. And that's beautiful so that when you look at the array of the beauty of what the plant has and what the plant has to offer, then you see, you know, the contrast. You see that floor plant with that tree plant, with that binding plant, with that hanging plant, with that plant that, like the skin dapsis, that just binds down. So, and then when you have a collection, you have multiple collection, and as I often say, you get that jungle feel, and I like that jungle feel. And that's what I'm aspiring. Forgive me the plastic at the bottom, but I don't want any dirt to come out. So if you hear that plastic, that's what that is. But isn't that beautiful? This plant is often confused and uh, thought of as the Prince of Orange. Sometimes people see the Prince of Orange, but you can tell because the Prince of Orange, that coloring of the leaf, this is more of a cinnamon color. That's actually orange. And then the difference with that is, is as you see these leaves that have, let me see if I can turn this, that have a little of the cinnamon on the edges, the Prince of Orange doesn't have that. And so that's a way that you can tell if you are thinking that one is one and one is the other. And so I just wanted to bring this again, like I always say, I'm trying to get it close enough to the camera so that you can see it and see the difference. And you can see in like this leaf here and this leaf here, you see that, and that cinnamon on the green, that's a way that you can indicate that that is the Macaulay's and not the Prince of Orange. But yeah, something that's beautiful. It's a beautiful plant, just something unique, 
something different, something hardy, something that you can add to your collection if you are um, a new timer to plants and you want to start, this is an easy plant and so if you want to start other than what I've already told you about it being toxic if you have children and or if you have pets and so look at that. Well draining these plants do like sun in order to get the most vibrancy out of the coloring in order to get the most vibrancy out of those leaves it needs indirect light but it needs enough of the indirect light to give the plant what it needs that it can give you the most out of the coloring. Other than that, it can be grown in low light. Although if you grow it in low light, the color, the maximum of what you can get out of the coloring would be different. So if you see people who have this plant or if you see a video and or pictures and the plant doesn't look as vibrant, they probably are not giving it as much uh, bright indirect light as it could receive and so the coloring is not as much as it would be vibrant but when it receives as much light as needed and give it the right watering and the what the right um humidity well then there you go and i like this because it's something unique it's something that um gives you something to look at you're always going to get a new leaf as you see that new leaf that's unfurling if you could see within that vein you're going to see some orange and then it'll shimmer down and that's what the leaves do they'll shimmer down from the cinnamon to a darker to the green and then they'll get darker green and as the plant continues to grow new leaves it'll keep doing it so throughout the lifespan of the plant it's going to show different colors on the plant continually and i like that the Macaulay's Finale Philodendron. If you have not subscribed, please consider uh, subscribing. P please consider hitting that like button because I always put out new videos and you know people are requesting things and so I want to say this too. If you have left me a comment about you know different plants that you want to see and or an uh, update to plants that I've already um, did videos on, I received those and I am working on. And so thank you. Peace.